Hello, welcome to today's video, which as you saw by the thumbnail and title is obviously a grocery haul. So if you'd like to see what I picked up um, and how much I spent, then please keep on watching. Like it, or just so you know, I do upload three times a week, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So it's about budget food, but also healthier food options. So make sure you subscribe, hit that notification bell. Thor, you better not do it. Thor. <laughs> Sorry, just got back from the laundromat and He's messing with stuff. You know how cats are if you own cats. But anyway, make sure you subscribe. Hit that notification bell. All that jazz. So anyway. Okay, so I actually have my receipt here. I did do a pickup order, but they usually never gave me my paper receipt. But this time they did. So, um, I picked up two pizzas. We haven't had frozen pizza in forever. But I picked up Sean a three meat pizza. It's a, uh, yeah. He likes three meat and where I don't eat pork or pig or whatever um, I got four cheese super exciting they need to make a pizza that is like has doesn't have pork on it they need to make like a pizza with turkey pepperoni I need that in my life but anyway these were on sale um, I got a dollar off a, p a pizza so which was pretty good so they were like a dollar 79 something like that per pizza Sean said this sounded good, so I picked up one of the Encore chicken parm things. So I got those. Um, I said it's healthy. Uh, obviously, I missed that memo this week. Um, I picked up some chips, chip mates. They're basically like chip ahoys. Chips ahoy. There we go. Um, cookies. These are actually pretty good. Sean likes chocolate chip cookies, and he doesn't eat a lot of snacks or desserts, but thought we could we would have some of these some sometime um I also picked up oh I picked up a diet root beer for myself because Sean has uh his um thrashed apple cans that he likes so I picked up yogurt per the huge and I get store brand you know what I mean they didn't have the store brand um, blueberries, so they gave me the Yoplait, which is fine. They let me know it was going to be a substitution, so not a big deal. Um, I got some sugar-free International Delight Caramel Macchiato creamer. So, got some butter. And I picked up a thing of cheese. Oh no! That sucks. <laughs> I was like, what's on my bag of cheese? Uh, yeah, it's a, a yogurt exploded. That sucks. Okay, I'm going to have to clean that up. Okay. It's just part of the deal with if you do pick up. So that one needs to be cleaned as well. Um, so I got Sean his seven um, peach yogurts that he likes. And then I also picked up a thing of a gallon of chocolate milk. So at the grocery store, like at my regular Kroger, I spent $36.45. So not horrible. Did okay. <coughs> um, I go to the laundromat that's by the Dollar Tree. So went to Dollar Tree. They have absolutely nothing like beauty-wise. So didn't get anything beauty-wise. Got all groceries. So, um, I picked up some of the oven baked fudge mint cookies. I did a review on these years ago. These taste exactly like the Girl Scout Thin Mints. So pick them up if you like Thin Mints. They're the oven baked. They're super good. Me and Sean are addicted to these. These are the scrumptious wafer rolls. They're chocolate filled. Um, I'm going to be real honest. Um, if we open these, they'll be gone in one sitting. You don't get a ton in here, but Sean loves these as well, so got one pack. And then, I can't remember if I've tried these. I probably have, but um, these are the Oven Beach Oven Baked Fudge Covered Peanut Butter Cookies. So got these to try. And then I got a Coke Zero for me and a uh, Dr. Pepper for Sean. But the things that I'm excited about the most, and you'll probably see these on Friday, one of these, but they have the Valentis. I don't know. I, don't, I can't really. Yeah. So they're these, um, yeah, these pasta sauces. 
and a dollar twenty-five. Like I was complaining last week that uh, pasta sauce has gotten super expensive at my local grocery store. So I picked up the garlic flavored pasta sauce and then the marinara. These are made with real California tomatoes. It's made in the USA. It's made with 100% olive oil as well. So I'm definitely going to be trying one of these out. You'll probably see it on Friday. But And I spent um, $8, a little over $8 at the, at the Dollar Tree. So all in all, I spent what, like less than 50 bucks? On groceries for the week which I don't feel like I did too bad and I feel like we've got a lot of snacks which will last us like three or four weeks and then obviously the pasta sauces are gonna go in the pantry and stuff like that but I feel good about what I got and yeah there we go um, uh, I hope you did enjoy today's video if you did please go to give the video a thumbs up and share it let me know down below in the comments if you have seen um, the pasta sauce, pasta sauces at your local Dollar Tree, and what are some things that you are picking up um, at your local grocery store? I would love to know down below, and of course, you are more than welcome to follow me on my other social media, my Facebook and Instagram, and it is at Budget Glam Babe. Don't go anywhere quite yet. Another video should start autoplaying here very shortly. You can always click on one of the ones that'll be popping up around the screen. But yeah, I'll see you here in just a sec.